Howdy folks, Justin here, and I realized something when I was trying to record a video earlier with uh, a Skeever deck. There are no new card. There are no cards left that I have have like any burning desire to create new decks with, and that made me sad. So, in an effort to create new and unique game states, we're gonna play a singleton deck. We're gonna hop with Monk, and after this, I'm gonna make another one. Um, what I'd like to do is you guys tell me in the comments what class you want me to build a singleton deck with, and uh, I will uh, the next day, you know, whichever is the most popular response. I will put that together and record with that. So let me know in the comments what class you want me to build a single deck list. The only thing I'm going to say is not um, not mage because those are the ones that I see the most of. Um, we will keep Murkwater Witch against Battle Mage. Hand got worse, although Phalanx Exemplar should be pretty good. There's Astrid. Yeah, and so the singleton decks, you play them because you have access to Siege of Stros Makai, you have access to uh, Morakai, and you have access to the set's um, Masterwork support card. Um, they're really powerful cards. Uh, whether or not they make it worth it isn't really the point. What you get to do is play a whole bunch of different kinds of games because you get different cards. Like you. There's Camorn Hero. Seems likely he swings into my guy, but he might not. It would have been nice to hit the Moonlight Werebat as a prophecy. We did not. Sometimes these, uh, like, really aggressive Battle Mage decks, so don't even run Firebolt, so Moonlight Werebat might make it. We stand united. Yep. I have no fear of this cowardly right to the dome. Okay, two chances of the prophecy. Did not hit one. Finish off. Okay. Alter Despair. My only play is Moonlight Werebat. Unless I... The void awaits you. Put out Lydia. I am sworn to protect you. And I shouldn't have actually swung already this many times, because now Afflicted Lit is going to give him a card if he uh, hits it. More cool Gatekeeper. Mud Crab Ankle Snapper. Sure. I'm just going to play Phalanx Exemplar. We'll never give ground. My opponent running the All Reach All Day deck. We do have to finish off with a charred creature that tries to go through the Shadow Lane. Brutal Ashlander. <laughs> this guy's serious about his plan here. Okay. We're gonna get more face damage in there. If I play Moonlight Warbat, he has to swing into it, but he has a two power Brutal Ashlander over there, unfortunately. So we're gonna play Clockwork Scorpion. So he swings it, that's five. He has to swing it with both of those to kill it. I used to be an adventurer. Okay, more like hero. Devourer will remove something. Honor and blood. Face, Die, face, honor. prophecy. Bless us, Kai. May we serve you with I put that word. there. That was a good prophecy honor to hit. So I swing here, swing here. And Morakai is another great draw. Alright. Thanks, buddy. We're back up to 15. I assume you make this swing. Maybe you don't. It goes face. You go face. Elixir of Vitality. Oh, no. All right, so Elixir of Vitality. Sheer Point Dragon. All right. <clears throat> Up to 11. 
and a concession. Close ranks. Let nothing no. Through. Opponent keeps going. Alright, um... The bonus is my strength and my courage. I think we're fine just losing our web after one swing. Like, I have all the time in the world right now. Yeah. Sets Masterwork. Eclipse Baroness. Orb of Vermina. We have a Cauldron Keeper in the deck, and I'm at 17 life, so I don't feel like I have to use my Elixir Vitality. There's an Inflicted Lit, which is why I should not have sworn earlier when I did. I keep a spare blade in my Crown Quartermaster. Yeah. Well, let's see what we take from it first. Actually, let's get Alter going. Three cards. If all three are lightning bolts, he can't cast them, but... Let's just make this guy 5-5 five, five so he can't get lightning bolted. Yep. Yep. Absolutely, man. Brutal Ashlander. Okay, um... Well, House Carl for more life gain. It's nothing personal! These streets are mine. Let's get a broom of profiteer. Ah, oh, night of the hour will do nicely. Let none defile our temple. By our service, we honor Kai. Do some more stuff. For the main. All right, we are at twenty. Could play the Wood Arc Headhunter, I guess, with the uh, completed contract. Doesn't seem unnecessary. Sure. Yeah. Okay. There's Cauldron Keeper. Let's take a card from his deck. Mud Crab, Ankle Snapper. For the main. Swing, 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 swing. And we'll let fake Lydia take home the prize. Alright. That was cool. We got to see a lot of neat cards. Alright. We'll back for game two with Singleton Monk. Don't forget in the comments to uh, tell me what class you want to see me play, build a Singleton deck for next. Um, I will, as long as it's not Mage, <laughs> uh, or Monk, I guess. And I will build one and record with it and release that video soon afterwards. Uh, I really enjoy the Singleton deck building experience, and I like the games that result from it. Uh, let's play against Stormcoil and have him uh, make me eat my words by crushing my face in with something better. Maybe it's a Singleton Mage and we can have just the most ridiculous game ever. Okay. Well, I'll keep Thieves Guild Recruit. Probably not going to keep Clockwork Scorpion or Dank Harvester on turn one. Okay. So how do we fare against a Control Mage deck as a Singleton Monk deck? Well, we have Journey to Sovngarde, which isn't like as strong as it used to be, but we have Orb of Vermina in our deck, which is pretty good. My scale. Let's try to beat him down a little bit. I mean, we don't have any play for next turn, but then we can go Phalanx into Sheer Point into Dark Harvester. <laughs> okay. Lightning Bolt down. We'll poke him. We'll pass. Phalanx Exemplar likely to eat a Cast in the Time or a Piercing Javelin. That's fine. We got a lot of big boys in our deck still. Has guard. I'm sorry, it does not have guard, has whatever that is. We'll never give ground. I scale moving shadow. So if he javelins this, it's not gonna be great for us because we'll only be able to put minus two, minus two, and then swing for one into it. 
Cast in time. I don't have any more of those. I don't have any more of anything. Swings face. Okay. Um, altar would be interesting to get Unglum going, but I think we just need to do this. Swing face. Hopefully he takes the trade here and doesn't just keep pushing face damage, but you never know. Maybe he takes the turn off because he's just got a bunch of late game stuff and get alter running. Premier Profiteer into Cloud Rest Illusionist. That sucks. We do get to play Dark Harvester. I'll swing into this to make it less terrible. Opponent has five cards in hand and 37 life. I think I have to play Mechanar next turn. Karth Spire Scourge. Behold my power. Right. Dawn's Wrath, right? We have a Dawn's Wrath in here? We don't? No. Uh, there's Morkai. Alright, let's play Mechanar. Let's build something beastly. That's not great. Not great at all. We'll take the guard one. Which actually will discounting Odevin could be pretty important. Face. Punish. I think I have to javel now one, even though I assume he trades this one in. He doesn't seem to be interested in doing much besides going face. Okay. You won't Still swings. Gold brand good if he doesn't have any more craft to put on the board. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. Uh, we do have Siege of Stros Makai next turn. As a possibility. Vicious Drag. You won't spoil my plan. Why not? And Arrow Storm. Alright, let's play Midnight Snack. Someone out there? Guard Edition. Morkai the Deathless. Elixir of Vitality. Back up to 20. Some heavy hitters in our hand. Opponent is in Marak Manticora range. Piercing Javelin. So we can just Odiving. If he Maraks it, I can Manticora his. My, my old Odiving. I don't really want to play that. Because I'm just going to Odiving. Your storm is no match for mine. We swing. Now we know he's not on Singleton, right? Oh no, he only played the one vicious drag? Huh. Thought he'd play more than one. Carthspire Scourge says he might be a Singleton deck. That would be Mir Miraculous. No, second Javelin says he's not a Singleton deck. He drew his zero cost Elusive Schemer immediately. Memory Wraith is a bit of a bummer, because I was planning on using a journey. There's an Eclipse Baroness. I don't want a Siege because... You have that in your deck. Right. So that destroys that. Swing face. Save the last charge of that for now. Yeah, I don't want to play Siege because I know it will hit Journey to Sovereign Guard. <laughs> There's also not a lot of great targets for Javelin or Cast into Time at this point. Gotcha. Still face. We can do this. Cliffside Lookout. We can do this. Cliffside Lookout. Um. Orders are clear. Just give me a name. The night mother will die. 
Respire Scourge. Okay. Not a singleton deck, but running stalwarts, solitude stalwart, devour. There's a plan. There's a profiteer. Cliffside lookout. Face. <laughs> all right, cauldron keeper. Let's get a two. Don't want to move a creature. Let's get a three. Guard. Okay. Let's get a card from his deck, Mystic Dragon. Final card from his deck, Elusive Schemer. Final Elixir Vitality Charge. I think we'll Siege of Stros Makai next turn. I mean, we have, what, five creatures in our discard pile? It seems like enough. We're saving this because we don't have a lot of just unconditional removal. And there we go. Okay. I steal this. I Manticora it. Kill both these. Go see Gourmet. They'll be needing a poultice. Get a four drop. Teach you to mess with me. Five drops left are Knight of the Hour, Loyal House Carl, and Lydia, and Protector of the Main. Do we want to just plow through our decks and, so we can cast? Well, let's see if he has a removal for this. We still have a cast in the time and a piercing javelin. Devour. Lightning bolt swing. Okay. We have stabilized. Rinholf. You can't escape. Clockwork Scorpion. Brynolf, Elusive Schemer. Oh, keep it coming, casting the time. Yes! <laughs> awesome. We'll be back for a third one. I Am I undefeated with this deck? Like, between all the, vid the two videos? Find out next when we lose. back for a third and final game uh, for this video with Singleton Monk. Don't forget in the comments to let me know what class you want to see me build a Singleton deck with. And I will do it, record with it ASAP, and get it out there to you. Um, yeah. Just don't be mage, don't be monk. Those are the two that I built. Uh, but yeah, whatever you think would be interesting, and I'll try to pack it full of as many interesting cards as possible. Alfie118 is our opponent in this round. Let's see what Alfie's bringing to the table. The Clever Archer. Okay. So, how do we beat Rage Archer? Um... Well, first we start by uh, having the Ring of Magic, I guess. Hive Defender, Murkwater Witch. I guess we keep Hive Defender just in case it's not Rage Archer. We'll see what happens. We run a healthy number of prophecies. I think we're more, we're better against aggressive decks than we are against slower decks. Um, because we have so many... Uh, answers. They're, you know, diverse answers, but they're answers. Um, the, you know, the more cards you include in your deck, diverse your options get. What have we here? Alright, Thieves Guild Recruit, that's cool. We'll play our own Thieves Guild Recruit. Dark Harvester. What have we here? Coming on in. Piercing Javelin. So we need to save our cast into time. Some amazing rage card. Wow. How's Kinsman not a card you see much of anymore? Um, let's play Hive Defender. He, he can't play Leaf Lurker next turn, although he can play Finish Off. But 
two for winning himself would be good for us, I assume. Rapid shot and to finish off would be super irritating. And that's what he does. Okay. We will Murkwater Witch that. Maybe get a prophecy here. There's an execute. We have Cloud Resolutionist execute up now, which is nice. So far, we look like a pretty normal deck. Pretty normal monk control deck, I guess. What do we got? Swing. House Kinsman. Naked Dune Stalker. So we're going to take a minimum now of six from his house kinsman. A lot of ways in Archer, of course, to kill off a 3 1. Soul Rest Marshal. Oh, this is old school. Into Soul Rest Marshal. Into Dushnik Yal Archer. Well, I suppose it was only a matter of time before we lost the game. Uh, I'm going to play Clockwork Scorpion, but I'm about to take a lot of damage. Some prophecies would be cool, of course. Next turn we have access to up to 8 Magicka, so we can Cloud Rest, execute something, and play Black Sap Protector. <clears throat> and he's got the belligerent giant. All right. I need some prophecies. Okay. Darren Cup first. They're in my sights. Another prophecy. Just give me an Okay. Okay. Another prophecy. No, protector of the main. Okay, so it's nothing personal. We have nine cards in here. It's nothing personal. I have to travel on that. The bonus is my strength and my courage. Probably dead to Cliff Racer. Alright. Yeah, Solaris Marshall into Solaris Marshalls. Not something I've seen in a long time. Now we gotta finish off for Leaf Lurker or some shit. The forest is my cloak. Yep. Cool. Absolutely. Um we'll record one more because that was super grating. <laughs> and I need to win one. I know I've won like se I'm seven to one or something like this deck, but I so need. So that's the first one. time that I've been soul resting into soul rest in 2018. It, I don't even remember being soul rest marshaled into soul rest marshaled in 2017. Um, maybe last spring, but it's been a while. Um, there are just of course more broken things to do now, but that is still just a super aggravating feeling when you're trying to uh, you know piecemeal control the board. That is just incredibly frustrating. Our opponent is Dalvarius, the Memory Master. Uh, we'll throw back Siege. They're playing Warrior. we we'll keep an Execute, Bruma, Sanctuary, Pet. Finish off. Okay. So, uh, I said uh, previously that we were probably better against aggressive decks than we were against controlling decks, but that deck's just non-stop mid-range beats. There's a plan. There's always a plan. He could charge a Battle Rage Orc into it. We'll see how I think that's okay. So we're going to Sanctuary Pet this, and then we're going to Hive Defender. Just gain some life as we go. I 
So far, looking like a pretty reasonable deck. Finish off, not in a lot of monk control decks necessarily, but... Let's see what Dalvarius brings next. My arrows shall fly true. Is it two sharpshooter scouts? Skaven? A oh, withered hand cultist. Okay. Withered hand cultist is irritating, but nothing we can't survive. Um. So this is Doomcrag, maybe? Well, I thought it was Doomcrag when I saw the sharpshooter scout, but if he's packing these guys, so revenge. Okay. A dark moment for you. Sure. Let's get a prophecy. Alright, just test it. Fast turn. A dark omen yep. for you. My claws are sharp and thirsty. Venom tongue crossbow. So this is definitely Doom Craig. Cleric of Kine. Bless us, Kine. May we serve you with every word. Okay, I can Dark Harvester next turn. We are running like one of almost every single prophecy you can run. I am ready to join Circle Initiate, sure. It's a little irritating. For the warrior wife. Let's go past turn. Getting some reasonable work out of our Bruma Profiteer. It would appear that dinner is served. There's the Doomcrag Vampire. Okay. Ghost face. For the warrior right. Okay. One Doomcrag vampire down. Yep. A nine drop. Blood Magic Lord. Oh, we're just gonna hope it's not raised dead. We're gonna swing. We're gonna play Mechanar. Steal Blood Magic Lord from him. Those are both awful. Um, we'll take the ping. Okay. If he has a silence effect, putting it here is a mistake, but... I don't... Well, maybe, yeah, probably was a mistake. Lucian... Shadowfen... No, Quicksilver Crossbow. Oh, that's alright. Okay. Looks for vitality is nice. So do we just Tazcad into this thing? He got Drain Life or Shackle Elaine. So we Tazcad into this. What do we have left? That leaves us with Javelin. He comes at us for two. Okay. <clears throat> so we need to stay. A, we need to make sure that he can't get us to five. If he had raised dead, he would have played it. If he had gargoyle, he would have played it. Am I gonna lose this guy finally? Ruptga guides my hand. Huh. We must protect our strong. So 
just keep gaining life. We got Odeving. Odev Odevin coming. Crossbow, are you finally killing that thing? Nope. Pushing face damage. Your reckoning is at hand. Okay. I think we got time. My time is precious. Murkwater Witch. <laughs> Sorry about the phone in the background, guys. It just keeps going and never stops. Nobody ever answers the phone here when I'm <laughs> recording videos. Your storm is no match for There's Odeving. And now we're dead. Your is yeah. Ahead. Casting the time. There's the gourmet. These streets are See what we draw. So I can put down two guards. Let none defile our I temple. Cures for all bills. And then I can territorial viper it. If it if I'm still at twenty two now. Why would you drain life now? Okay. I shall end their blasphemy. Sharpshire Scout gonna not, not gonna do a whole lot of work. Hits me for five. Is his hand just filled with sharpshooter scouts and stuff? We'll see how they like someone who Protector fights of the back. innocent. Leaf Lurker was a great hit here. My arrows shall fly true. The forest is my cloak. I am ready to join the circle. Okay. Just dump your hand out, man. Let me Odeving. Well, unfortunately, he has two more Sowers of Revenge, and I'm at 12. There is plenty for all. Crotwood Ambusher. Okay. My arrows shall fly Sharpshooter through. Scout. It's the last card, man. As long as I draw okay. Little house, Carl. Gortwog. I will prepare something special for them. By our service, we honor life. Still two Doom Crags. I did that on that so we couldn't ping it. I should have done it on this one, I guess, so that it didn't die in combat to uh, as many things. Quicksilver Crossbow. Okay. I'm just going to play Gortwog. There's Marak. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. What do we not want to pull? I mean, Marak and Odeving are in hand. Uh, I'll take any of it. We have 24 cards in our deck. We must protect our stronghold. But we have... Yeah, pink face. Daedric Dagger. I think I steal that, right? A little distraction might... Oh! Ho, 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 ho. That must be hard, man. That, that must be hard. Okay, we're at 13. We have Journey to Sovngarde at some point. So we're not going to deck ourselves. 
<laughs> All right, man. More guard creatures. We're just waiting, right? We can't kill him this turn. I mean, I, I have pretty good answers in my hand. I will keep Sota Sil's people Galen. alive. Galen. And the last card is... Is... <laughs> Lydia. I am sworn to protect you. I shall end their blasphemy! Teach you to mess with me! So what did he shuffle into his deck? We'll see how they like someone who fights back. Repel the outlanders. Uh -huh. Now that is what I'm talking about right here. Life gain. Behold my So, if he has a way to kill a creature, he'll do it now. Do you not fear me, mortal? Yeah. You should. Okay. There's Clock of Scorpion. There's Unglum. Let's swing. We drew a Brotherhood Assassin. For the man. Maybe the, the drain creature should have been in different lanes. For the glory of the it's his Gorwag. Yeah. Daedra Dagger, Quicksilver Crossbow? No. Devour. For the main. That was a 13. What happens if I Merak this creature? Am I even... I'm not allowed to do that, am I? I do not believe I am allowed to do that. Let's draw another card. I lurk in the shadows, waiting. There's a journey. We know. We had a prophecy. I have twelve on board. There is plenty for all. Grab what ambush doesn't do it. And we win the game. I forgot that that takes forever, that animation. I just wanted to send my opponent to Sovngarde. Enjoy the Hollow Heroes, friend. Alright, thanks for joining me. Don't forget in the comments to let me know what class you want me to build a singles and deck with. I will do it, and I will enjoy every minute of the experience. Thanks very much for joining me, and I will see you all on the ladder. Bye-bye.